for another ad scene on our daily vlogs, which is just where I share things that people notice from our daily vlogs that we use in real life and have asked about or been curious about or wanted to know more about. And so today I'm going to talk about our under the cabinet TV, which lots of people are curious about. And that is all it is. It's an under the cabinet TV. That's all that's called. Ours actually can't find ours anymore because ours is old and Kyle and I got it on clearance and I'm pretty sure that <laughs> it doesn't even exist in an updated model anymore and so my specific one I can't really go into detail about but I can tell you about under the cabinet TVs in general and ours is a DVD player, um, TV, and also a radio. It does AM and FM. So I really like ours a lot, but we got it when we first got married and I would watch TV while I was cooking dinner or cleaning the kitchen or the living room and I could see it from our, our old house or I would listen to music or I would watch a DVD. Like I just loved it. It was just kind of like my little, you know, self-indulgent thing I could do <laughs> while I was doing chores basically. And then we have the kids and of course the kids it works out nice for them too. We have a rule like no TV at dinner or anything like that but breakfast is when I use it the most and that is because usually a lot of the times we're eating breakfast kind of at different schedules. It's scattered. Um, we have activities in the morning. We're really busy so I need to run do my makeup while the kids are finishing their breakfast or run to you know laundry or something so usually during breakfast is when I utilize that thing a lot you know I, I, I use it to for Grayson he's finishing his breakfast he takes a lot longer to eat and then I can get Sophie's hair put up in her ballerina bun for ballet etc you guys get the idea so that's when I utilize that a lot. <laughs> I also turn the music on a lot during the day when the kids are downstairs I mean obviously sometimes I just play we have a little like jam box thing and you just play your, you know, any Bluetooth phone or anything from it. So we use that a lot too, but I still turn the radio on. I also like to watch the news as long as the kids aren't running around. I'll turn the news on in the morning and kind of pay attention. Or sometimes if Kyle's running late, I'll flip it on and see if traffic's crazy. So it's kind of nice for that. And so that is all it is. It is just an under the cabinet TV. If you look it up, you can find them everywhere and they are designed they're all designed um, from what I've seen to fit variety of cabinets if you think your cabinets are too you know they're they're too narrow they probably have one that'll still fit that um, if you have a lip under your cabinet they always come with these little lifts that will lower it and still allow you to do it they just screw in they're so easy to install they don't damage your cabinets or anything and so we actually undid ours and moved with it and our cabinets in Austin still looked great and so um, actually I think at this point we've had this one for so long that the next time we move we'll probably just leave it here and go ahead and invest in a new one at that point, maybe something fancier, although honestly I don't really think I need something fancier, but uh, <laughs> anyway, that's all it is. Just Google under the cabinet TV and you can find one. I would definitely recommend getting one though that does DVD player and or Blu-ray and uh, you know, and the TV and the radio just so you have options. Like if you're gonna get one, get one that like lets you do all of that. So yeah, there we go, that's what that is.